Yo, yo what's yeah, going on, sexy seven one squad? Today we're doing a ra okay. <laughs> I guess talking's not really in my uh, my repertoire today. My repertoire tar. <laughs> Oh no! It's going. It's going down. It's all going down. I'll never be able to show my face in this city again. My repertoire of speech does not include the words 1v1, duel, or smite. That's what I was going to say until my body decided that it was against all odds that I would get those words out of my mouth. And they were right. I won. I, I lost, actually. I won in the end, but I lost initially. Um, anyways. Oh, hello. Nope. Playing a little Lancelot today because I haven't played Lancelot in a hot minute. And um, I just wanted to see, like, I don't know if he has any changes or anything to him. And if he did get any changes... I wanted to see if I could feel them or if I could see if he was any better or, you know, basically just how Lance is doing as a whole. Now, the two does more damage, but the one is easier to use. So I'm going to press that button more. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn. I actually just kind of chunked him. There's no way he comes over here, right? Right? Okay, he's not. All right, let's go one one, and get the XP for that minion. There we go. I'm feeling pretty darn good right now, man. Let's look at that. I don't remember what Lancelot's passive is. Can I be honest? I know, like, I got him diamond in one stream or whatever, but. What's his passive? <laughs> Knock back. One. One. You are better than me. That is for Sir Kong. Ooh. Let's go. Oh, man. Look at that. Look at that. I'm astounded. I am actually astounded that that worked. I think he died to archers. <clears throat> yeah, I think he died to archers. I don't think my one actually hit him. I mean, I'll take it either way, but... All right. All right. Pumpkin. I'm body blocking. I cannot do this. That doesn't kill. I have 200 health. All right, watch it, watch it. Watch and learn. Let's go. Let's go. Huge kill. Dylan is killing. That's his name. Dylan is killing. All right. Use 30 mana to turn around because that's something that high risk thought was good. And then boom, full wave clear. Let us put a point in the two. Go get soul leader. I kind of want to go vampire. Vampire Lancelot. Like soul leader, blood forge, Aussie. I do a lot of damage. Holy crap. I guess I do have a halfway stack transcendence at the three minute mark. That does make sense. Can I not lose all my minions? Stop. <clears throat> I do want to do red. I feel like he'll yoink it from me. Uh, all right. I'll wait it out. Don't 
back. Damn it. I am so tanky. Why am I so tanky? I've built literally no protection. I am not scared of you. Oh, geez. I'm a little scared now. Let's go. So what I did there, by the way, was I used my shell. I used my shell before getting onto my horse because if you use your shell before, it adds to that shield that is required to knock you off your horse. So basically what it does is it gives you a bigger window to stay on your horse to be able to do damage. And because I'm not actually leveling up the horse, uh, the shield is really low. So I get knocked off of my, my horse really fast. I feel like I kind of needed the extra, the extra HP because even archers would have knocked me off my horse. I'm pretty sure. Man, Lancelot is fun. I don't know why I stopped playing him. Probably because he's not that great. Probably because he's not that great. But honestly, I mean. It doesn't even feel that bad, you know what I mean? Ah, oh, crap. Alright, ow. Okay. Oh no. Let's go. Let's go. That's actually terrifying that I can do that. Ah, no. I missed. All right, this is ultra greedy. I'm actually using my horn chart here. Oh my god, wait red buffs up too I have to go for it I can't let him get a buff what is he doing okay okay all right that was good Nice. All right, get me out of here. Oh, God, he's coming. Oh, God, he's coming. Oh, goodness. Oh, goodness. All right, let's go vampire. So what vampire is, it's a lot of lifesteal, um, but it's a lot of sapping their energy. So what we're going to do... Is obviously Aussie Soul Leader, right? You get a little bit low. You need a little bit boost of energy. So that's what the Aussie's for. Um, Soul Leader, because obviously I'm eating their soul. I'm a freaking vampire. Um, What else is good for eating souls? I know I'm losing stuff. It doesn't matter. I'm going to win this game. Um, is there any defense that's good at eating souls? I mean, arguably Arch Druid because he hits me and then I deal even more damage back like every vampire in every movie ever. Um, honestly, let's do it. Uh, let's see. Well, there's obviously Serrated. Serrated is a good vampire item.
What else is a good vampire item? That hit me? What the heckle? Nice. Soul Eater finished. Benito. I suck. I'm garbage poop and shit. No! Bring it on. Bring it on, butt scratcher. Nice. Let's go, dual orb. Let's go, dual orb. Big clear. Now we do the blue. Skada. Skada you. And now let's do the red. I'm still trying to think about items that are like sapping energy. You know what I can do? Actually, hold on. Bear witness with me. That's Chris's stream. Hold on. Uh, YouTube. Vampire smite build. Rexy. Two months ago. Hello, Rexy. What's your build? You have serrated. You don't have Aussie. Serrated. Oh, I, Cad Cadisius Club. All right. It's fine. Ah, oh, Jesus, that was loud, man. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, Rexy, it's fine. We get it. Jesus. All right, let's go serrated. Oh, hey. <clears throat> I can actually go serrated now. I do feel like Arc Druid is. I'm just going to go straight in. All right, so I'm going to go Arc Druid and Caduceus Club. <coughs> Why? Oh, does that increase life steal? Wait a second. Does Cad Club increase life steal by 30% because it increases healing? Hello? Oh, okay. I am coming. Oh. I have no idea where he went. Oh, there he is. I'm coming. He can't run forever. Ow. All right, maybe he can. Maybe he can run forever. How much is this? 1750. Come, Gregor. Oh lord, I'm coming. I'm stuck. Oh no. Come, Dragon. Okay. Actually close. Wait, I'm gonna go get my Arc Druid. I know I could get Phoenix here, but that would that would be too easy. I'm just gonna go get Arc Druid. And then I'm gonna get Blink. Can you blink on your horse? You cannot. Okay, good to know. I wish I knew that a little bit earlier, but it's still fine. And then last item, Caduceus Club. Because if that does increase life steal by 30%, that's pretty insane, dude. That's pretty insane. Gow, gow, gow. You backed. All right. <clears throat> no big deal. Is there a wave all the way back there? No, you're not getting blue. Yeah, you didn't think so, did you? 
You didn't think so, did you? My blue buff. And you know what? This is also my red buff. Level 20. Bring it on, Bupkis. Oh my god. My Arc Druid just did 300 damage to him. Holy crap. Arc Druids is kind of good still, huh? Because that's not even max stacked, was it? And it's is it still true damage, by the way? No, it's magical damage. It used to be true damage. It's pretty good. All right, and Cad Club. I'm officially a vampire. Hog. <clears throat> You know, I feel like Cad Club isn't going to do that much for me. So let me think about other potential vampiric items. Shadow Drinker sounds vampiric. Um, but it's not really vampiric. You know what I mean? Stone of Binding. Um... It's got to be something that when they hit me, I get stronger. Like, that's what Arc Druid does. That's what Serrated does. That's what Aussie does. Soul Eater is just because it's Soul Eater. Um, I guess I could go... I guess I could go, uh, what is it called? What is it called? What is it called? The one that like berserker shield. I know it's physical defense, but honestly, I could go abyssal. Lower his cooldowns by 20%. He has max cooldown. So that's annoying for him. Let's do it. Would never turn down such impressively crafted armor. All right, cool. So now we're like a complete vampire. He hits me, I get stronger with both Abyssal Stone and Arc Druid. That literally isn't going to do any damage to me. And then <clears throat> on top of that, if he gets me low enough, my Aussie procs. And while the whole thing goes on, I'm getting stronger by using abilities with Serrated. And with Soul Eater. Let's go, dude. I'm happy with this build. Bring it, Bupkis. Look at that, dude. Look at that, dude. Arc Druid with another 200 damage smack. By the way, Dual Orb just spawned in the middle of the map. Imagine if I needed the dual orb to kill the, the Phoenix there. I would have felt so cheated. Wow, I'm full HP. <clears throat> I actually don't think I can end here. Oh, I can't end. Oh, I do a lot more damage than I thought I did. Holy crap. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, y'all, peace.